This week on the American Huntress. It's springtime in Texas, and that means it's time for a visit back to FTW Ranch. Join us this week when I meet up with my good friend Jason Hornady, his daughter Abby, some new friends, a lot of surprises. You're not going to want to miss this show. It's going to be a blast. Hornady presents the American Huntress. This week, I'm headed off to FTW Ranch to meet up with my good friend Jason Hornady, his daughter Abby, and to do a little Sam Precision training. Over the past five years of the American Huntress, the Hornadys have become my champions and my friends. I also have another really dear friend, and that's Tim Fallon with the FTW Ranch. Hey guys! The greeting oh. committee, the formal greeting committee. <laughs> How are you, sweetie? I'm great. When I found out that Jason had a daughter that hadn't hunted before, I was so excited because this is really what our show is about, is passing on the tradition, bringing these kids into the outdoors, and being able to experience that in a family environment. SAM course, which stands for the Sportsman's All-Weather, All-Terrain Marksmanship, is designed to make you a better hunter and to prepare you for any type of hunting adventure. It turned out that Jason and Abby's flight got delayed, so we didn't get to meet up until the next morning. I tried to stay up. I tried to stay up. <laughs> uh -huh. I, gave it, I gave it up at like a quarter of 12 and I went, I've got to go to bed. Oh, I'm sorry. We were late. <laughs> First morning, FTW. Hornady boys got here really late. Abby, I'm sure, is very tired, but she's a trooper. She's up and at them. But like Tim said, a chance of rain. It rained all night. It's raining this morning. Good news is we're gonna do a little classroom introduction to the course, so rain won't matter. It just has to now blow away. It is our job as a hunter to kill your animal in one shot, not hope you hit it. Your days of hoping to hit an animal are done, they're finished. If you can't make that shot in the heart or break the shoulder, the heart, lung area, whatever, kill the animal instantly, don't shoot. It's that simple. It's called hunting, not killing. Team one today will be doing SAM precision type work. That's medium caliber to varmint caliber work. Team two will be doing SAM safari. All right, so now we're going to whoosh, class. Good class. Okay. Before the handling of any firearms, the SAM course always has classroom instruction. instructors, who are all current or former special ops, did a great job in teaching us the basics of shooting and shooting at long ranges. But I could tell Jason and Abby were ready to get out into the field. So was I. Later that afternoon, the weather was still miserable, but we weren't going to let it stop us. The American Huntress is brought to you by Hornady. Accurate, deadly, dependable. Krieghoff International. Verkunen, Waffen. Zeiss. We make it visible. Houston Safari Club. Get in the hunt. Diamond Blade. Performance Forged in Steel. Briley Manufacturing. A legacy of shooting innovation. Ravenware. Special garments for outdoor enthusiasts. Luminox. Essential gear for every outdoorsman and sports enthusiast. And Ruger. Arms maker for responsible citizens. <laughs> This segment is brought to you by Hornady. Accurate, deadly, dependable. I joined in the team from Cabela's for the safari training course, where we learned how to react 
and how to shoot when hunting dangerous game. Hunter, stand by. Take him. Look, step, back pressure the gun, squeeze, reload, reload. And it is safe, it is safe. Finger off, safety on, high port. Elena, I think this was your last shot. I think it was too. Yeah, you had two of them side by side. Yeah. I saw the gun kind of pop in your hand a little bit. And I think it wasn't quite in your shoulder when that released, I think. Even though I was having a great time, I really wanted to see how Abby was doing. So I let the guys finish the safari course. Later they told me I missed out on a whole lot of fun. Good, good. Step to your left. Take him again. Take him again. Take step to your left. Oops. Take him again. There you go. Good. Up. Oh, take him. Take him again. Take him again. There you go. Good. 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 Cool. Good. Later, when I went to call Wind for Abby and Jason, I had a big surprise. And look who I run into. You know, they say the state of Texas is really big, and it is, but it's a small world. It is a small world. I'll tell you what. Of course, I don't live that far from here, which is a good thing. And every chance that I get, I'm up here at the ranch shooting. So, and I wasn't sure that you were going to be here. I just heard there might be some horny folks, but I should have known. There you go. There you go. So we're going to have a lot of fun. We're back up here. We're going to finish the precision shooting course with Abby and Jason and uh, got a little help from Mr. Whitetail. <laughs> so. I think Abby was a little nervous at first because she tended to be a little bit quiet. And I think the classroom information may have either bored her or gone over her head for a few minutes, but then all of a sudden you just saw it click. She was calm, she was steady. She had taken in everything that Dog had talked about in that class. And the SAM course is a great way to get anybody started in shooting, comfortable with a rifle, real world scenarios. They run you through targets from zero to 500 yards, as well as close up scenarios. And I thought, what a great way to start. Plus we might get somebody who knows a little bit more about shooting than me, teaching my daughter how to shoot right, get the right techniques, and not have some of the bad habits that I know that I have. Better. Raise your head a little bit, Abby. Remember, keep your head on your gun and ride that bull, okay? We got the gun going, got her set up, and all of a sudden you can see it click. Yeah! Yeah! Woo 400 yards. And she hit the paper, she hit the bullseye. All of a sudden now she's got a decent group going. She's starting to understand trigger control building their base and she's shooting really well. <laughs> now I just hit a nine inch plate at 400 yards, are you kidding me? Well then we start working our way out and at 500 yards, clang, first shot. And you should have seen the smile on that kid. Yeah! Yeah! First shot! <laughs> she walked it out and 500 yards, bang, first time. She was dead on. Good job! FTW, 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 be advised. We have new members to the 500 yard club. Oh, yeah. Well, let me tell you something. I'm very proud you today. You did a great job. You hit 500 yard steel today. Good job. Yeah. That's Three awesome. Five exploding. <laughs> <laughs> did great. As you know, we, we raise non-indigenous animals here on this big ranch and we're conserving the species. Anyways, one of them is an axis deer and we have a um, kind of a tragic situation, but you could help us out if you wouldn't mind. Um, these animals are wild and crazy here and they're in, in the wild and they do what they do and they fight. And we had two bucks uh, probably five to six months ago getting a very big fight. One of them got gored very badly in the, in the intestines area. He's not going to make it. This animal's suffering. He is, he's starving to death. I think what he did is he got gored badly enough that he can't digest and he's losing weight. It's not good. What do you think we should do? Hunt him. 
All right, let's go. <laughs> great, thank sounds, you. Sounds like a Again, plan. Again, I'm proud of you today. Sounds it's like great. a plan. This segment is brought to you by Houston Safari Club. Get in the hunt. The next morning, Abby and Jason were up extra early to see if they could find that injured axis deer that Tim had told them about. our second morning at FTW and Miss Abby here nailed the 500 yard target yesterday afternoon. Where did you go this morning? I heard that you may have done a little hunting without me. <laughs> we went up to one of the blinds um, but we didn't see the axis deer we were looking for. Okay well I think there's going to be an afternoon hunt in store. After Abby's been through the SAM course now we're in a situation where we're ready to go hunt. I'm sure we'll see something, no doubt in my mind. This deer we were looking for it ended up coming but it went behind a tree so we couldn't get it and then when we were trying to see if we could find it again it went back up the draw so we couldn't find it and we're gonna try again in the morning that's what happens huh 
kind of frustrating, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Well, we'll get another go. Well, they learn young. <laughs> this segment is brought to you by Zeiss. We make it visible. It's our last morning here, and I'm going to head back out again, see if I can get the injured one, and hopefully I do. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> shot sweetie one shot wow that's pretty good let's take a look at him see how big his antlers are huh he's still rubbing the velvet off man right through right through the shoulder isn't that cool yeah really fun uh, I'm really proud of him that was really good. I'm Abby Hornady and I'm at FTW Ranch and yesterday I took a SAM course and today because of that SAM course I was able to shoot this great access book. One shot wasn't it? Yeah. About 100 yards. Yeah. This is a really neat place. Yesterday Abby was hitting gongs at 500 <laughs> yards and, and closer and today we were able to see a great access buck. He came right out of the woods out of nowhere. One shot. I'm really proud of you. <laughs> really proud. Thank you. Come on, give me hugs. All right. Come on. Good job. This was a killer for me because there just wasn't enough room in the blind for all of us. And I am a mom. And to not be able to be there when Abby got her first animal was really tough. I'm so proud of you. Thank you. What a beautiful animal. It's Oh, yeah. Well, oh, yeah. for the 500-yard shooter, only uh, perfect. Only perfect. Dad, move over. <laughs> Were you shaking, Abs? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> now that it's official, you have your own American Huntress hat. Thank you. You're welcome. Ah, I'm so proud of her. This is the official Huntress initiation, and all hunters go through this. All right, close your eyes. Makes Smile. you official. Here we go. There you go. All right. It is official. A new American Huntress is born. Well, again, this is what the American Huntress is all about. I can't tell you how special it was to be part of Abby's first hunt, albeit Jason was there as he should be and I wasn't, but I was living vicariously. And when she came into camp with that deer, it's just like I was there. We're passing on this tradition. This young lady has just taken a giant step into her future. This is a day Abby will never forget. Very rarely do you have an opportunity like we did 
I got to bring my daughter down here. We walked her through the fundamentals of shooting, not only shooting, but hunting. We ended up in a situation where, of course, she's learning cons conservation. She's learning how to shoot. She's learning all the right fundamentals. Got to shoot a great axis deer. I have to tell you, I've had a really good time. I got to do this with my daughter. She got to learn a whole lot. We had a lot of fun. And certainly the crowd down here at the FTW Ranch and Linda, the American Huntress, she's a wonderful host and we've just had a great time. Kind of sad to go. Thanks for watching this week's episode of the American Huntress. And thanks for joining me and Abby and Jason and all our rowdy friends at FTW. FTW rocks! Hi, I'm Linda Donahoe and this is the president of the Houston Safari Club, Mr. Gene Newman. And we are out at the Shoot for the Troops clay shoot which is a very special event every year to the Houston Safari Club. Gene, tell us a little bit about this event and what all is taking place today. Linda, this is an annual event for the Houston Safari Club. Uh, it's called Shoot for the Troops, and the proceeds generated from this event go to our uh, proud wounded warriors. And it's absolutely the best place to meet the best friends in the world. And don't forget Houston Safari Club's Worldwide Hunting and Fishing Expo coming up this January 11th, 12th, and 13th, 2013 at the Woodlands Waterway Marriott. And for more information, you can go to www.houstonsafariclub.org. Get in the hunt. The American Huntress is brought to you by Hornady. Accurate, deadly, dependable. Krieghoff International. Verkunen, Boffin, Zeiss. We make it visible. Houston Safari Club. Get in the hunt. Diamond Blade, Performance Forged in Steel, Briley Manufacturing, a legacy of shooting innovation, Ravenware, Special Garments for Outdoor Enthusiasts, Luminox, Essential Gear for Every Outdoorsman and Sports Enthusiast, and Ruger, Arms Maker for Responsible Citizens. I thought you were leaving me alone. Yep, <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>